Well, did it ever feel like football season out there tonight? Hello and welcome to the Dean Trailways fifth quarter. As always, we thank you for spending your Friday night with us. I'm Audrey Dahlgren. And I'm Nick Mantis. We have made it to week seven of the season, and tonight our tour around the town starts in the CAAC Red. Yeah, Gary Houghton and his Mason Bulldogs can call themselves the outright league champs after taking down St. John's 41-6 to tonight. A.J. Martell had 127 yards and three touchdowns, while Case and Carswell also had three TDs. And now now that you know what they did, it leads us to our big game. Yeah, so those Mason Bulldogs beat Hazlitt and Williamston already this season. And tonight, the two teams tangoed for a second place spot in the CAAC Red. Now, Willie the Hornet was buzzing tonight, as was the Williamston student section in all black clothing. And they would need to be loud against a tough Viking squad who had a 20 to 6 lead when we pulled up. And they know exactly how to add to that lead by handing it off to Nakai Amakri, who finds an opening and takes off 78 yards to the Casa to make it a 21 point game. But the Hornets fought back in this one as Alex Petersburg connects with Noah Dunkel out in the flat, who gets to the outside and tiptoes his way down the sideline and in for a Willie touchdown, making it a three point game. It all came down to an onside kick. The kick bounces off a Hazlitt player and goes out of bounds as the Vikings would kneel out the rest of the clock to win it 30-27 to the final, beating Williamson for the first time in five years. Another goal of theirs achieved in their 2022 campaign. I mean, you know, it's crazy. Um, you know, I mean, there's nothing better, really. Friday night, you know, beat Williamson. Like I said, we had this targeted. We had them targeted for a year. We've been in the weight room every day thinking of Williamson, and, you know, to get this win is huge. It's huge. You know, anytime you play them, you know, no matter what it is, if it's football, basketball, tiddlywinks, when you're playing Williamson, you know, it's time to step up, and you know you're going to be in an intense game, and, and it's just great for the program. Uh, you know, we've come up short for a couple years in a row against them, uh, one-score games, and we found a way to pull this one out tonight.